Hi, I'm Nugs the Final Girl, and today I'll be your mommy horror correspondent. Brought to you by ScaredyCast, a podcast that does everything weird, paranormal, and horror. Happy Mother's Day to all the horror mommies out there, and here is my list for the top five horror mommies. Number five, Norma Bates addressing the Bates Motel series with Via Farmiga and oh my goodness is she a MILF and that is definitely something I'm looking for in my top five horror mommies. Now she is a good mom kind of but she does have a tendency to murder, con, steal, anything to make sure that no one is messing with her little Norman. Number four, Nola from The Brood. Now, Nola may not be the best mom on this list, if you can say that about this list. Um, she comes from a lot of trauma, a lot of mental and physical abuse, and so she becomes like the ultimate mom, the queen mom, if you will. I use queen mom in this sense because she has found, found a way to birth children asexually with just a, a disgusting pouch attached to her. So go the brute. Number three, Mother Firefly. Mother Firefly has a few children, three children by two different men and an adoptive son, Otis. And unfortunately, a child that did not make it, but she does keep it in a jar and named it Little Wolf. Mother Firefly has a long rap sheet, so she will do anything for her children, especially disposing bodies. Which really goes to show you there is nothing stronger than a mother's love. Number two, Annie Graham from Hereditary probably our most normal mom on this list and that's why I put her on here. She is devoted to her children but because of you know hauntings, possession, family trauma, cults, uh, spoiler, uh, she has a bit of a hard time. She's pretty aloof but she is artsy and has a lot of miniatures so that's good. And in mm -hmm. my number one spot is Mrs. Voorhees. All these moms kill, hurt, you know, do bad things for their children, but I feel Mrs. Voorhees really embodies that horror mom facade. Facade's not the right word. Regardless of the word, she took matters into her own hands, got revenge, and for the first movie, you don't know that it is her. And she has that element of surprise of making you think that she is a 300 pound, 6'5 man that can kill all these kids. And you know what? Something to look up to. Just kidding. Don't murder people. What are your top five horror moms? Let us know so we can compare lists. As always, I'm Nugs the Final Girl, and I will see you later.